This video is about the Label Frames widget. The Label Frames widget in Tekinta is a frame, which is a container you can put other widgets into, which also has a label attached to it so you can name what that collection of widgets actually are. So here's an example of one over here, the Label Frames around the outside, so there's a collection of labels, and inside I have two labels that I've placed. So let's look at the code that gets that to happen. Um, and we'll have our usual in importing to Kinder and starting our window up, creating our window and having our main loop. Now actually in the adding the window content, first off I'm going to put the um, label frame in. So this is line here, I've named it example label frame, I've given it a name, label frame comes in, um, it needs to go into the root window, the text of the label is as such, a collection of labels. And now here are two um, more little um, arguments that can be put in. Um, so this will give pad X and pad Y. So it's basically gonna have around the inside a spacing of um, five pixels in the X, so that's left and right, and five pixels in the Y, which is up and down. So just put a little bit of space in around it that makes it easier to read. Once we have made our um, label we need to now pack it into um, our um, root window so it's been packed in now so if I was to run that it wouldn't really appear in there because there's nothing actually in the frame and frames don't appear until nothing appear nothing is put, something is put into them so let's put a label into them so we get a label and like we did last lesson I'm using the um, brief um, way of doing it so just a label example label frame it goes into the example label frame it goes into this up here the text is this is a label and then I'm going to pack it into a grid within there so I'm not going to pack it and use grid to go in at row 0 and column 0 and sticky W um, is again another configuration you can use for grid which allows you to say whereabouts is this aligned is it north is it south is it east is it west so sticky w means we want it to be aligned to the west as far west as possible you also have northwest and and northeast etc so um, there's other ways you can align where the object goes within the actual um, grid within the cell of the grid that it gets put into and i'm also then going to put the second label in uh, which is going to be pretty similar again it goes into the example label frame um, goes into the grid and this goes into the second row, but the first column. Uh, now both of these lines are a bit long. I'm just going to show you a little short, a uh, little um, um, bit of formatting if you want within um, Python. So if we press a backslash and go enter, that just basically says continue this line, this code on the next line. Um, just makes it a little bit neater so you doesn't go all over the place, especially when you start putting more and more um, details into your labels, you might need to start putting them over several lines. Um, so if I've done that now, I should be able to save that and run that, and here it pops up, and there is our label, so you can see the padding around the inside of the labels, it gives a bit of space, and you can see that both these labels are left justified or west justified. Um, so there we are, that's how we use a label frame.